took our windmill tower down got a new windmill to put up okay. pretty much all out of PVC I hope the blades last about maybe I should say the blades will last about maybe three years at the most because the sun will rot the PVC what? downside of using PVC blades Here's the old one. I tore the box out. Getting the pipe out of it. The motor was out of a treadmill and it would only spin fast enough to produce about one and a half volts. Well, one and a half volts is not going to do very well charging batteries. Yeah, the solar panel of this unit. Right now, it's not getting very much sun. It's snowing. Stuck the windmill on this uh, bridge rectifier. Basically, the windmill comes in, the plus comes off, the minus comes off, comes up, goes in the plus, and minus. Because that windmill didn't have a diode built into it. The diode there is for the solar panel. The solar panel didn't have a diode in it either. So we stuck one right there. We may redo it later. May leave it that way. Probably put a bus bar or something on for the power. This thing just goes in and plugs right there. That's it's upside down. That's the way we needed it. Upside down. Eh, well, not really. All the electronics don't care if they're upside down or not. Currently, there's no power there because I can tell there's no power because there's no lights. And I can come down here. See if we can read that. Sitting on zero. Just putting nothing out. I don't expect the solar panel to work very well in the dark or in the clouds in the snow. Don't expect the windmill to work when there's no wind. See, it's snowing today. Put new blades on our windmill. You can see it's turning. And I can't even feel the wind. That one's not turning. That one's not turning. But that one's turning. I know it's not feeding through it. It's a AC three-phase motor. It's sitting on a three-phase bridge rectifier. If I can zoom in to the lazy Susan a little. <clears throat> See the board sitting on top is a little bigger than the one sitting underneath. <coughs> Maybe I should say the board that the lazy Susan is sitting on is a little bigger than the 4x4. Actually I used a 2x6. We decided to put a new uh, piece for the tail and to hold the tail. What I did was bought pieces to reduce that uh, six inch PVC down to an inch and a quarter, which is the pipe on the tail, and then glued them together. Where before we just used an end cap for a six inch and drilled a hole in the center of it. 
it didn't hold very well. Then we painted the tail red and the pipe green and painted the blades. I used the information of one of the videos from the guy that does the uh, green power science videos to make those blades off of uh, tuba force. So that's a 92 inch blade. Or about 8 foot.